Come on, Mechanicals. We have Fiona fire truck in today. Whoa! I'm Wilbur T. Weasel, owner of Weasel's Wheels. Fully automated to fix things fast. Hello, Mr. Weasel. I'm Gecko. Oh, here's my first customer. Every job is quickly done, so Weasel's Wheels is number one. See you, Frog. Uh, the name's Gecko. Okay, Floella. Won't take long. Hmm, I'm not too sure which button starts the service. Oh, pressing them all should do the trick. <gasps> Come again, Felicity. That was quick. Oh dear, she doesn't look good. Come in, Fiona. Let's have a look. That's the problem. Weasel was in such a rush to get things done that he put soap in your tank instead of oil. We fixed the problem properly. Now Fiona's running bubble free. Hmm. I'm sure I pressed the right button. Oh, yuck! Oops. See you again soon at Gecko's Garage. Bye! <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Gecko's Garage. Oh! It's very muddy today, so we're getting our car wash ready. Oh, look! Here comes Baby Truck to get all cleaned up. Ooh. <laughs> oh, hello, Baby Truck. <laughs> Let me guess what you're here for. <laughs> Splish, splash and splosh. Activate Gecko's car wash. That's not right. You're still all muddy. Of course! We haven't filled it up with soap. You can't get squeaky clean without soap. Now the soap is filled to the top, we can wash all that mud off. Oh! Hmm, that's strange. The rollers are meant to roll the bubbles off. <laughs> Ooh! Aha! That's it! Baby truck is too small for the rollers to reach. Ah! <laughs> is working and baby truck is sparkling clean it's cheerio from gecko bye <laughs> hello everyone gecko here today's a very special day it's baby truck's first visit to our garage so we want to give her an extra special gecko's garage welcome <laughs> Hello, baby truck. Are you nervous? Oh. 
It's okay. You're in safe hands. Right, Mechanicals? Truck, we'll find her. Quick, mechanicals, we need to find baby truck. Uh, hmm. Poor baby truck. Where could she be? Huh? Are you hiding, baby truck? Is it because you're nervous? Guess what? Me too. It's your first time at the garage. We wanted to make your visit extra special. I'm sorry if we frightened you, but I promise we'll take extra special care of you. Is that okay? <gasps> garage doors open at speed. It's time to help a vehicle in need. Have an amazing day, baby truck. You are so brave. <laughs> You're welcome, baby truck. Thanks very much for joining us at Gecko's Garage today. You're right, Green. There's a fire. It looks like Fiona Fire Truck is on her way. <laughs> oh, no. Mummy and Baby Truck are having a play race. They're drumming too loud to hear Fiona's siren. <gasps> Fiona. It's time we fitted you with a louder siren. <coughs> Come on, Mechanicals! Time to fit Fiona's new siren. Need a nice loud Nino sound. All done. Give it a go, Fiona. That's not right. It sounds like a doorbell. Let's try again. And that sounded like a dinosaur. We need a Nino. That was a Nino, but it needs to be much louder. Hmm, that traffic cone made you louder, Yellow. Maybe something like that will work with a siren. Now that's a loud Nino. Bye, Fiona. Thanks for visiting Gecko's Garage. Hello there everyone, Gecko here. It's a lovely sunny day, so I thought I'd do some bird watching. Oh look, it's the twins, Barry and Carrie. Oh, they look like they're having a lot of fun. Oh no! Barry's crashed! <gasps> Quick Mechanicals, we need to help! Go, go, Tilly Tow Truck! 
Sorry, Barry. We'll soon have you out of there. Blue? Hey! Yay! Let's get you checked over. Hmm. That's strange. Your engine won't start. Ah, Carrie's come to cheer Barry up. How lovely. Oh, I knew there was something fishy going on. That fish must have been stuck in Barry's exhaust. That's why his engine wouldn't start. It's so nice when your friends come to visit. It helps you get better much faster. The fish is home safe and sound. His friends must have been worried about him. Well, all's well that ends well. We'll see you again soon. Bye! Come on, Blue. I think it's time for bed. Good night, Mechanicals. Huh? Bobby, what are you doing here so late? <sighs> oh dear, you need a new wheel. I can fix that. But we need to be quiet. <gasps> ah! <gasps> ah! Phew! That was a close one. Done, Bobby. Good night. <sighs> Perhaps I'll hmm, just sit down for a moment. Ah. <sighs> Monster truck. What can we do for you today? <laughs> oh, you want to look like your hero, King Crash? <laughs> I think we can do that, Max. I'll get my tools. Mechanicals, you get started. My tools. <gasps> Mechanicals! What have you done? Oh, you all might think he looks great, but it wasn't what he wanted. Don't worry, Max. We'll put you right. Another happy 
customer here at Gecko's Garage. See you all soon! <laughs> Almost back at the garage, Mechanicals. Whoa! Someone's dropped rubbish on the road. Hmm, there's lots of it. And Mama Recycle does not look happy. Come on, if we follow the trail, we'll find out who's dropping it. Trail goes to the left. <gasps> it's Dylan, the dump truck. His broken tailgate's dropping litter. But his music's so loud he doesn't notice. We've got to turn down Dylan's music. Let's recycle and save the day. Using things we've thrown away. <laughs> Dylan! Dylan! Oh? Your tailgate's broken. But don't worry. I'll fix it! <laughs> While Mama Recycle and the Mechanicals sort the rubbish! <laughs> All done! How's the recycling going? See you again soon for more adventures at Gecko's Garage! <laughs> Dylan, turn it down! Oh, what a lovely sunny day! <gasps> What on earth is that? Whoa! With this big balloon, they'll be able to find my garage from miles around! Ha <laughs> ha! Who could that be? I'm busy! Max? More air for your tyres? Fine! <gasps> Wait! Mr. Weasel isn't putting air in Max's tyres. He's using the helium for the balloon. Which means... <laughs> Don't worry, Max. I'm coming. <laughs> oh, the spinning screwdrivers. How is it my fault? Oh. oh, don't panic, Max. We'll think of something. Max, if I let some air out of the tyres, we'll go whooshing along like a balloon. <laughs> there you go, Max. Good as new. I'll show that gecko once my advertising balloon is ready. Could you pass me a spanner, please, Blue? <laughs> That's not a spanner, Blue. It's a wooden spoon. Hmm. Sounds like baby truck. I wonder what all the excitement's about. <laughs> Presenting Wilbur T. Weasel's new electromagnet. <laughs> oh, oh. How do I turn it off? Oh no! 
Mr Weasel's got magnet trouble. Everything's fine, Gecko. Uh, if you could just switch off the power by turning that bolt. Blue, stop! A magnet attracts anything made of metal. Oh, oh no! Mechanicals! Oh, I know, Mama Recycle. I need to turn the power down, but I can't use a metal tool. <gasps> of course! The wooden spoon! Huh? It's okay, friends. I'll free you soon. With a tool I made from a wooden spoon. Ah, that's not going to work. <laughs> Everyone okay? Oh, great! We'll see you all soon for more adventures at Gecko's Garage. Bye! <laughs>